hi. It's the tiny one slash Bishi. And we're going to play some more of the adventures of Nick and Willikins. Uh, <clears throat> if you hear like banging and loud noises in the background, I am sorry about that. Uh, my uh, roommates I have right now are moving out. And they're just cleaning out the back bedroom for the new roommates that are going to move in. So yeah, let's continue. Uh, we have to find out why this guy died. Let's see. Uh, I dare say he looks familiar, but it's difficult to tell with him lying face down like that. Also, I'm certain I don't know any corpses. <laughs> okay, let's roll over. Getting an idea of who this was and why he's here would be an excellent idea, and this police tape is hardly going to stop me. There is no... But I'd rather not contaminate the crime scene with my own fingerprints. Oh, there is no police tape there. Ugh. Okay. No. What about the vase? Just a vase. Nothing special about it. Mm. Uh, is there something in here that we can use? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what's over here. Can we go over here yet? There's another vase. There's nothing particularly special about this one either, except that this one is a vase. Oh my god, seriously. Okay. Let's go to the front garden. I've always thought this thing was a bit unsettling, but I'm also fairly certain that there should be two of them. Surely one of them didn't just get up and walk away though, did it? <laughs> and do I actually want an answer to this question? <laughs> Oh my god, that's funny. Uh, anything else we can- Oh, what's a dolphin? Let's come over here. I know how he feels. I want to vomit all the time, too. Oh my god! <laughs> Let's see. Oh, no, 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 no. Pass the garden. Maybe there's like gardening gloves or something like that we can get. That's the sun! Oh god, I hear another voice. That's funny. After Nick's latest ill-conceived project, one in a series, collect them all, is his so-called Hedge Maze of Doom. Do you These have... are the plans for Phase 2. By Stage 6, I believe the intention is to incorporate the whole of England into one massive, impassable maze. So, we all have that to look forward to, I suppose. What is that other voice? Oh my god. Shit. Master Nick believes this is a TARDIS. A vast improvement over that time he believed it was a porta loo. Oh my god. Hedge. This hedge maze began as a topiary animal. A very tall, very square snake. What? This has been struck by lightning 37 times. Okay. Which is three less times than I have. Oh my god. It seems to have flown off the handle. I can relate, little garden implement. Uh, let's pick it up. Dare you enter Nick Hall's Maze of Doom. So nice of Master Nick to offer a choice. He doesn't usually bother. I believe, in this instance, I daren't. Oh, you don't- I want to go in the maze! You don't want to go in the maze. Okay, fine. I want to know what that voice is coming from. This has been struck by lightning oh, yeah, 37 yeah, yeah, yeah. times. Which is three less times than I have. Uh, I wonder if we can find the source of the voice. Let's go back then. Go back! Oh, what's the black note? This was left by an activist of some sort. It appears to have been left here somewhere around the time our deceased friend arrived in the entrance hall. Oh, clue. Okay. Okay. A new number has been added to your mobile. Uh, Alright. 
Hmm. Let's look at it. This was left by an activist of some sort. Ugh. It appears to have been left here somewhere around the time our deceased friend arrived in the entrance hall. Typically, I'd ignore such a person, but perhaps they have information useful to my investigation. No, I don't know. White note. It seems that someone attempted to deliver a package around the time of the murder. I wonder if the delivery person saw anything. It appears to have one of those bloody QR codes on it that everyone seems to think people actually use. This one looks more like an owl to me. Okay, how do you access the mobile? Uh... No. Options? No. Uh... Ah, hold on a minute. Sorry about that. Uh... I think you go to the phone inside. This is where the birds live. <laughs> this is where the birds live. Okay, and then oh, it's not gonna. Let's just go inside then. Okay, now there's police tape. I applaud their efforts, but I dare say I've overcome significantly heartier barriers to my duties. Okay. Um. Oh, wait. Oop. Back. What's this? Gallery? What's in here? I hear someone playing video games. Do you? I had to pay that tiger 60 quid to lie down and pose for that. <clears throat> Oddly, the puppet's lips never moved, but Master Nick's did. <clears throat> don't know why that dog's so unhappy. It makes more in a year than I do. <sighs> this used to open, revealing a button that did nothing. Mercifully, it's since been sealed shut. Uh, uh, yeah, what's, oh, this. There was once a descriptive audio service that accompanied this painting, filling the hall with a constant ear-piercing howling. Oh my god. Somehow it became disengaged. Somehow. Who knows how these things happen? Uh, who knows? Not me. This was identical to the bust over there, but we left it on the dash of the car on a hot day. Whoops. I thought this said poop art at first. Master Nick modeled for this one by pressing his face against the screen door. Oh my god. Charles the Plant. This isn't a painting. It's a plant. It's a, uh, what's in that door? It's a door. Yeah. We don't have a special word for door here. It's the same as your American door. Oh my god, dude. Just go inside. Sassafras. <gasps> Can you, like, boop the nose or something? can't click anything. Did you poke it in the eye? Oh well. Okay, uh, let's go back this way. Uh, let's go back this way, entrance hall. Um... What's in the drawing room? Cool, there's been a right argy bargy out there this morning. I don't know it's described as a full on foofra. What on earth is going on? Who is that? Well, ma'am, it seems there's been a murder in the entrance hall. Oh, it's his mom. We are currently looking into who the victim is and what exactly happened, but you'll be happy to know that Master Nick is more or less fine. Well, in future, see that you keep your so-called murders someplace where I can't hear them. I nearly couldn't go back to sleep after all that racket. Oh my god, I should have been ruder. I fear I did all the reading I'm ever likely to do at Cambridge. 
Master Nick has threatened to have my eyes hobbled if I'm ever caught with a book. That's messed up. I'd prefer not to learn what he means by that if it's all the same. Oh my god, I see. Reading all these books is kind of a waste of time. Nothing interesting here. Reading all these books is kind oh, of a waste bye, bye, of bye, time. Bye, bye, bye. Nothing interesting here. Uh... Master Nick insists that Antelope rhymes with Penelope. No. A true gentleman's pursuit. So naturally Master Nick hasn't come anywhere near these. <laughs> I'll say this for Master Nick. He's a stickler for symmetry, fearful or otherwise. What is this? Ah, the king of the jungle. Except the part where lions don't live in jungles, nor do they have royalty. Uh, so they're basically Americans. Oh my god, dude. The television is not, at present, on. Uh, let's turn on, see what happens. It's stuck on the channel that tells you what's on the other channels that aren't this one. Uh. Oh my god. Until someone can get out and fix the satellite aerial, I'm afraid this is our only option. Oh, okay. Well then, go ahead and bloody fix it already! Okay, so now we have another job, is to fix satellite. Miss Petunia has threatened castration if I so much as go near her cuppa. I assume she means me, but I'd rather not find out, to be honest. They say Master Nick's good great aunt Petunia once had tea with Queen Victoria, which, for those of you who haven't memorized the British monarchs, makes her extremely old. Can I talk to her? Uh. Let's do friendly. Good morning, Miss Petunia. You're holding up well after the recent unpleasantness. I always hold up well. Quite firmly, some might say. Some presumably must, yes. Uh. <clears throat> I wonder, my dear, if you might be able to help me locate proof of Master Nick's set. <laughs> what do I look like, a trained medical profession? I'm not one of them, just to be clear. But I do know a little something about playing doctor, eh? Ew! Friendly. I wonder, my dear, if you might be able to oh, help no, 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 proof no, no, of no. Master Nick's sanity. Okay, okay. I don't know why you made me do that again, but... <clears throat> okay, uh, okay. Alright, let's go here. Window. The hedge maze of doom seems to be coming along quite nicely, by which I mean horribly. <laughs> Master Nick planted the other antler in the back garden some time ago. Oh my god, and yet poor thing. no deer have sprouted in that spot. <clears throat> oh, that's a bad miss. Uh, it's a unicorn. Not actually the last unicorn, as seen in the book and the movie of the same name. <laughs> this is, in fact, the penultimate unicorn. Okay. What is that? <laughs> oh my god. Behold the thylacine. That looks All scary. Alright, I'm beholding. Now what? We'll do the same thing again. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, dining room, let's go up. What 
West Wing. Can I go into the West Wing now? The West Wing is approximately 80% oh, asbestos no, okay. by design, so it's probably best to steer clear of that. Oh, let's see what's in the, the kitchen. That's right, let's see. Huh. Chair. Master Nick typically dines alone and seats himself here at the head of the table. On occasion, he'll ask me to join him at what he calls the arse of the table. Rude. Oddly, the plant is completely real. It's the pot that's fake. <laughs> the official name for these is Other Swords. I suppose that helps distinguish them from the, uh, Other Swords. <coughs> okay. Uh, chair. Oh. Candelabra. Oh, the windows. One day, Master Nick will almost certainly pull one or both of these from the wall and then swing on the chandelier. Yeah. Which is why I've already invested in a special broom mm -hmm. for cleaning his bloody footprints off the wall. That's funny. Okay, where the windows do? Yet another view of Master Nick's so-called hedge maze of doom. Particularly foreboding in this light, I'd say. Okay, let's see. Uh, candelabra. I have no snark to offer here. I'm quite sincerely fond of how those candles flicker. Oh, that's kind of cute. Okay, uh, portrait of someone. We don't actually know this person. I believe we purchased this painting in an estate sale of some kind. Uh, uh, okay. An ancient ancestor of Master Nick's, with whom he was also once romantically involved. Our history, like the history of most great English families, is complicated and a bit incestuous. Ew. Okay, let's go to the kitchen. Let's see if I can find something in there. Uh, there's a knife. No, can you worry? Perfect for raw chicken, raw pork, and any other disease-carrying <laughs> slabs of unprepared animal flesh. Can I get the knife? No. Inspired after a trip to the bank, Master Nick insisted that we have this knife secured to the counter to prevent it being stolen. Ugh. It's probably best if he doesn't know about all the other items around the hall that I'm carrying around with me at any given moment. <sighs> okay, uh, I need gloves, so... A candle... No, mops. There will be plenty of time for that later. Uh. And later still. And pretty much on into infinity. Oh, can I go in there? You're witnessing a rare moment in which I have something other than pointless mopping up to do. Uh. Okay. Oh, pantry. I haven't been in the pantry yet. Okay. Fish. A fine, upstanding British fish if I ever saw one. Well, technically, these aren't so much upstanding as they are down-hanging, but the point remains. Uh, can I get the fish? Well, now I've got a haddock. Oh, okay. Not garlic. I'm not prepared to say what this is, but it's most certainly not garlic. <laughs> okay. We're not, I feel it's important to point out, French. Uh, uh dry goods. Good. Uh, okay, so that's all dry goods. Anything up here? More dry goods. Dry. Uh, oh god, that's funny. Sack. Master Nick insists upon having at least eight stone of potatoes available at any given moment. I believe this was after he'd seen a documentary about Elvis on the telly. Herbs. The H is most decidedly not silent. Um, I guess that's it in here. That sucks. Well, let's check on Master Nick. Little brat. Wait, 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 wait. See what's in the wine cellar. Uh. 
Master Nick was briefly obsessed with the idea that red and white wines would pale in comparison to this, the world's first blue wine. Then, as is usually the case, he got bored and wandered off. Okay, uh, I don't remember how long I've been filming from this clip and the last one, so I'm going to end it here. Thanks so much for watching. Stay safe, stay happy, and I'll talk to you all later. Bye!